about social media presence is, so we walked around UCF's campus with various Facebook and Instagram photos not featuring the Starbucks logo to see if people could identify that that photo was posted on Starbucks social media. This is the photo. Do you know what company that is? Is it Starbucks? Yeah! Yeah, 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 yeah. Starbucks? Yeah, yeah, yeah. As you saw, clearly people know Starbucks. Even without the logo, all the photos posted on Facebook and Instagram are iconic and easily identifiable, and there's no doubt that people know Starbucks from your photos on social media. they post the same thing on each one so having different posts on each social media handle like Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram will want their customers to go on their pages more instead of just visiting one page and not visiting the other pages. We basically also went around and surveyed a bunch of different college students and asked them their opinion on the Starbucks, Spotify, Coffeehouse playlist. like definitely coffee house like vibes like probably like I feel like I've never been to like Vesper or like Boston but like I feel like it's something that like you could hear in there like while trying to study. Um, I generally don't study at home because I just like can't focus and I like usually go to places like Starbucks to study. I could definitely see myself listening to this outside of a coffee shop. Um, maybe I, I'll try and listen to this at home see if it makes me feel like I'm in a coffee shop while being Oh. I thought the, the music sounded like I was at a coffee house and I felt like I could be at Starbucks listening to that music drinking a cup of coffee. Um, all the music that I heard basically makes me think of like what I would hear if I was just like sitting in a Starbucks. <laughs> if I was like listening to music while I was studying, I think I would think of like a coffee shop and want to go like get some coffee. Uh, we found that many college students didn't know that Starbucks had a Spotify playlist, but when we asked them their opinion on it, it was all very positive feedback, and we found that they felt like it made them feel like they were Starbucks even when they weren't. Recommendations to increase subscribers to the Starbucks Spotify channel is by having personalized ads every few hours that would give codes to the listeners that would either give a dollar off a drink or during slower traffic periods having a free drink given out. In order to redeem this code, a uh, customer would go to Starbucks, tell them the code, and then show that they're a subscriber to the channel. Starbucks will offer deals to social media users who like or share the post, which will gain more activity on social media for Starbucks and will give deals to customers. Starbucks brand and feel that our strategy can be very effective for the company.